Fire observer. My job is to support my joint terminal attack controllers. There's a plane flying around at probably 5,000, 7,000 feet. It's hard for him to see what we're looking at since we're on the ground. So what we do is we, we provide a mark to try to get his eyes onto the target. We usually mark targets with anything, laser, smoke, tracer rounds, and we make sure we kill the bad guy. Game plan is follows type one, bomb on target, one by mark 82 per aircraft. 30 seconds basically, the flight generator is line. A JTAC is the only person in the Marine Corps besides the aircraft that actually drop orders. They're taking responsibility for that ordinance. Hello families and friends of the 31st Mew. It's been a while since I had a chance to speak with you about the video series that we're currently working on. Since then, most of the Mew has embarked aboard the flagship of the amphibious ready group, the USS Bonham Richard. But to even get to this point, the Mew had to conduct several training events in and around Okinawa. We showed you Marines training on fast rope insertions, the underwater egress trainer, as well as chemical and biological response scenarios. We also put you in the middle of an infantry squad conducting a vertical assault and we put you in the pilot seat of one of our Ospreys to pull back the curtain of our air ground team as they come together to accomplish the mission. So looking ahead, we already have several exciting videos in the works that will bring you along with us on our spring patrol as we travel throughout several locations and countries in the Pacific region. So stay tuned, leave us a comment, and let us know what you think. Semper Fi. Move, move. Oh, we're about to extract. Move.